Cooper. North Cobb and their offense came out swinging against nationally ranked Cooper. Star game of the week. There's been a lot of points on the board and a lot of highlights. The Warriors reverse to the punch. This catch from T.J. Smith on third and goal sets up a beauty. He's got points down. Do they get it? Yes. Puts North Cobb up early. Seconds later, then the Riola Cooper responds. Devin Williams walks in for the score. This one is back and forth. North Cobb scores again, and we got a shootout brewing in Cobb County. We put up 24 21 at the half. We'll have to watch the big show to see who comes out on top. All right, we're going to have Victor's wrap up and so much more tonight on the big show. High Five Sports in just about 10 minutes. Tune in right here. Like I said, over 20 games. We are editing them as we speak. It will be fun all across our area. College football, of course, also getting rolling in full force this weekend. That includes George Tech and Louisville. You're taking a live look right now at Mercedes-Benz Stadium where the Jackets are looking to open their season with not just a win, but a conference win. Brent Key in his first game leading his alma mater as full-time head coach. And they look good. Jackets down 6-0 in the second quarter. Kane King to UGA transfer friends. Caesar, 7-6, tack on top. Calvin Johnson likes it. He likes this as well. Trey Cooley, actually used to play for Louisville, has two touchdowns in the quarter. Jackets fans had lots to cheer for. They put up a ton of points early. Quick hitter to Chase Lane, and look at this. He does the rest. 48 yards for the score. At last check in this one, going into the fourth quarter, Tech up 28-23 over Louisville. And the Dogs, they're kicking off their season tomorrow evening at 6 p.m., taking on UC Martin at Sanford Stadium. A win over the Skyhawks would make a little bit of school history. The Dogs have won 27 